guys and welcome back to a dress up Thursday and those who think I might not be around and are not seeing videos from me please make sure to turn on your notifications if you're still if you have your notifications on and you're still not seeing videos from me unclick it turn it back on if you also feel like you're going to my videos page and you're not seeing videos from me for a very long time Remember, YouTube has it's now okay. created subcategories under the video section, so you have to look at videos, then you have to click shorts, then you have to click lives. Let me tell you, if you don't see a daily video where I am uploading a long video, I am either uploading shorts, a lot of them, or I am going live. So one way or another, I am still here. Oops, hit that camera. So one way or another, I am still here. It's just YouTube is always changing their features, so they make it a little difficult. Also, it has been brought back to my attention that channels are being blocked again by YouTube. So if you feel like you are chatting in the live chats or you're leaving comments and you're not being seen, please email me your URL to your YouTube channel so I can check to see if YouTube has blocked you. So today's themes were vintage, uh yellow and um red which she's got the red for her strawberries and then the other theme was bugs so at the end of the video we will be dressing the babies in other themes in the meanwhile we're going to be showing you see some details here of dolly we're going to be seeing what she looks like when you hold her and seeing what she looks like when she goes shopping and eating because she's just so freaking adorable and you all gotta see it. Let's go ahead and get her a bottle. We're gonna use my favorite modern bottle which is the Munchkin Latch. It's one of them because I also like the Quattle bottle a lot but I need to reseal its nipples. Does anybody know what to use in the Quattle bottle nipples, the rubber, rubber nipples? I use silicone and it comes out so is there something that sticks really well in there? If so, let me know. I was live the other night on TikTok. Somebody was like, I want to see you holding the pickle because I haven't seen anybody hold her. And so I thought, let's hold her over here so you guys can see her in her fullness. We, uh, I was going to feed her, but we will do that next. But look at this girl. She's a big girl. So she wears nine month size clothing. And I think she's weighing, I think this one's weighing almost 10 pounds. I can't remember. I don't weight my doll super heavy, but she's still heavy for her size. So she looks absolutely adorable. She holds really nice. Um, I really like that. She just, look at that. She just cradles so well. And I just think she looks so real when she's on your shoulder. Look at that. You pick her up like that? Oh my gosh. Look, how cute is she? Oh my gosh. Absolutely adorable. She just holds so comfortably. Like, she's not awkward to hold. Like, some reborns will be stiff, like their limbs, the way they're positioned and stuff. And she just, like, cups your body, which is really nice. You hear the kitty candy? Yeah? Meow. She's looking at it. Oh, that's good. You do socialize. Look at each other? Come on, meow, cat. I don't know how to really work it yet. It's just purring right now. You see its tail? Ooh, that made her get up. Meow, cat. Look at me, Candy. I don't know. This is your new friend. <gasps> Do you, you hear that? You hear that? He's meowing. I don't know what that sound was. It almost sounds like a half baby. Ooh. Look at 
golly she is such a chunk and i just rode my scooter here which i'm gonna insert footage of jackie no <laughs> insert footage that jackie took of me so much fun we were live on tiktok when that all took place but here we are with miss dolly and her cute little strawberry dress from gail let's go see what kind of clothes they have let's go this way because everybody is just in the way they're really busy here right now that is such a pretty crib set okay dolly let's see what they got um it's all right i'm not really feeling this stuff right now i do like that green one a lot like this one would look really nice on her yeah. that would look really nice on her but she honestly has a lot of clothes Let's see what we have over here. Lots of red, white, and blue stuff coming in for all the upcoming holidays. <sighs> Not too much fun stuff. It's it's all right, you know. They need to bring in new stuff. I just need them to put out new stuff every day, and I'll just love it. If that was a nine-month size, I would be getting it for her. Matter of fact, I mean, does a 12-month size look too big for her? <laughs> yeah. Is that too big for you, Dolly? I absolutely love this set as well. Well, that dinosaur piece, I just love it. They have lots of red, white, and blue stuff here. Isn't it so just cheery? Oh, that is really cute. A little white onesie under that. Oh my gosh, that's adorable. Oh, I like this. USA, I love how it looks like almost vintage. Okay, I really want this one. But they only have three to six months. And Dolly, she's pretty wide. I need that six to nine month size. There's a new miniverse out. <laughs> At least new to me. I've never seen it at any of the local targets. Okay, let's go. They're right over here. Oh my gosh. I have never seen this one before. Look, we can get little birds. I'm thinking about getting one, but I'm also bummed that I don't have my cheat sheet. Or I don't know if there's a cheat sheet to this one. But I don't know what I'm going to get. So it's going to be a total surprise. Look at all those cute squishmallows. I remember when those sold out so fast. They're not that popular anymore, I guess. I want to get this toy, but at the same time, I don't. Should we get it and should we see how many babies it'll have? Now we got baby Ferngully here and we're going to get him dressed into this super cute Carter's line. I'm really impressed with my Dress Up Thursday theme here because I have the color theme yellow. It is vintage. This is from the same year my daughter was born. And it has bugs. Oh my gosh. And him, Royal, and Dolly are going to be wearing the same stuff. Well, it's not the same, but it is from the same Carter's line. So let's get him out of this bag. I really like this sleeping sack. I think this looks so adorable on him. And I seriously want to get more. I've never used these on the Reborns, and these weren't out when my daughter was a baby, but it looks so realistic on him. We're taking him out of a vintage sleeper, and his pacifier is vintage Gerber as well, and the blanket is vintage as well, and we need to announce Thursday's theme. What is next week's Dress Up Thursday's theme? What is it, guys? It's share your favorite book. So put it with your babies. Take their photo. Have fun with it. It can be a children's book. It can be, you know, a book that you enjoy as an adult. You know, please keep it appropriate for YouTube. You know, if you wouldn't share it with your parents... Don't share it with me for me to share with my crowd because I won't. So please uh, keep that in mind. But yeah, have fun uh, or take the book out and just take a beautiful photo of your book like out in nature or in your home. Share with us your favorite book. I'm going to be sharing my favorite vintage book or nursery rhyme. And this kit is halfway to being vintage, maybe a little bit over because... It is over 10 years old now. Not the kit itself. They're always being uh, produced, you know. But the kit came out over 10 years ago. Jackie and I got the opportunity to make the prototypes. I made Twin B 
and she made twin A and they were little biracial babies. They were absolutely adorable. Bonnie, Bra Bonnie had them on display at the doll show that year and they were so cute. She actually uh, paid us to make them and she kept them. Yeah, but that was a lot of fun. Oh my gosh. Look at how adorable baby Ferngoli looks. Oh my gosh. This uh, sleeper unlocks so many core memories that are super precious to me. And doesn't he look just so stinking real? Look at that little guy. He's absolutely adorable. I just, I just love him. He's just so cute. All right, let's see the kiddos. They all look so stinking cute. Look at those guys right there. Oh my goodness. How adorable are they? I absolutely love it. All right, guys, remember to stay safe, stay positive, and follow us on TikTok. We have been going there live a lot. See you guys later and bye.